There are four different main file types used in Autodesk Inventor, and I'm going to talk about the differences between them and what they're each used for. Um, the most common type that we use all the time are uh, called IPT files, which is short for Inventor Parts, and this is where we actually create individual parts and pieces like the, uh, like the base that you see here for this clamp. Um, our menus include modeling tools and sketching tools for actually creating these 3D shapes, and this is where the bulk of our actual creation is done. The next type of file is called an IDW file, short for Inventor Drawing, and the file extension on that is .idw, so you can tell the difference. Um, these are these these allow us to take our 3D parts from our IPT files and actually generate two-dimensional technical drawings from those parts. So extremely handy tool for for making um, making schematics, making blueprints, making technical drawings that we could actually dimension and accurately build a part from uh, in just a few clicks of the mouse. So a very easy way of taking complex mechanical drawings and making them appear for us. Uh, the third type of file, uh, the file extension on this one is .iam, which is short for Inventor Assembly, and in, a, in an assembly file we basically take a handful of different IPTs, different Inventor parts, we put them together and we can add constraints to make them act in a certain way with one another. So in this case I've taken this clamp along with six other pieces uh, I'm sorry, the clamp base along with six other pieces assembled the full toggle clamp and assigned constraints that allow it to, to move in just a certain way. And in this way, we can put pieces together on the computer before we actually build them and then try to put them together and find out that they have interferences or um, that they don't fit together right. So it takes a lot of the, uh, a lot of the time out of the testing process if we can test it on the computers first. And then the fourth type of file uh, are IPN files, which is short for Inventor Presentations. And they look a little bit something like this. We can take an assembly like the one that we just saw and make an exploded view out of it. These exploded views are, uh, are what you often find in, in sets of directions for you know, how you put something together. They show how all these parts and pieces go together, and we can actually animate this happening. So here we see all of our um, all of our parts zooming together and on the toggle clamp we can pretty well you know determine how these parts go together but on a really complex model it's really handy to be able to see how certain things interact with each other. So four different file types, four very different purposes. Um, they're all very useful, very helpful while we are modeling in 3D.